Each year when they have a birthday party, instead of having um, their friends bring gifts, we decide to come up with some sort of a charity to give it to. Last year in case we were helping a dog or an animal shelter and we had we raised money for that at our birthday and this year our grandma was in the hospital. We didn't even have to discuss it, just grandma's in the hospital. We're donating the money to the spinal cord program to help her. I'm just thankful that my grandma has the chance to be here. She does a lot of things for us and without her it'd be really hard. This year we decided to do Mary Freebed since the grandma was in the hospital or is in the hospital at Mary Freebed right now and we just pleased with everything that has happened at Mary Freebed and the progress that she's made. Very nice. On July 23rd, she had um, quite a major procedure back surgery done. She had went in from they went in from the front and the back, um, screws, plates, the whole thing, and it was about a eight, good eight hour surgery. And she was doing very well. The surgery went fine, um, but probably about a week and a half into staying at the nursing home, she had fallen. Um, you know, accidents happen and. It just happened, but the problem was that she had fallen, and we didn't know this at the time, but all the screws um, came undone. She started to develop a blood clot in her, on her spinal cord. Unfortunately, the nursing home thought she was fine, and um, that went on for a few days, and finally, it just got to the point that she was in so much pain, I decided to call an ambulance because something needed to be done. So then she went back to Mercy Hospital in Muskegon. They had about a liter and a half of blood on her spinal cord that they had to drain off. She was there for probably about four weeks. And once they got the all clear, all clear with her back, then the surgeon said, yep, she's ready to go to Mary Freebed. It's just been amazing, this place. First of all, the people are so nice um, and so cute. You can tell that they're so dedicated you know, to what they do, but she has come so far along. I mean, she still has a long road ahead of her, um, but she's come so far. We're very happy that we're able to have her here because it's a very nice place. All the people are nice here. The nurses are really nice. They help with my grandma. The equipment's really nice. Just everything's just the way you want it at a hospital like this. And we had um, set our sights on $400 to contribute, and we got 488 So we were quite happy with that. Um, that will go to the spinal cord injury program whatever they see fit to do with. We don't care. We just well no we know it's gonna go to good use. The kids actually Garrett, um, one of the the boys, um, he said when I was kind of typing out the invitation on the computer, trying to figure out exactly what we were gonna say, then he said, hey instead of having cards, let's do it where people make get well cards for the patients and then instead of giving us birthday cards because you know what birthday cards you know are nice and everything but i think when you're in the hospital not feeling so well birthday uh, get well card you appreciate a little bit more so i said yep you're right so we did that so we made oh, i bet we've got maybe about 40 cards or so from kids that will be distributed to, by the nurses it's just special to have her here just thankful for mary free bed.